Hello, and welcome to the NAFTC Amped Up AED Vodcast, plugging you in to the latest electric vehicle news. Today we're amped up to introduce our special guests, Rick Scott of Shell Oil Products and Steve Ellis from American Honda Motor Company as they discuss hydrogen use as an alternative fuel for vehicles. Well, you're standing at the uh, one of our premier hydrogen refueling stations in Torrance, California. Now this is built uh, in the uh, area where Toyota has a significant uh, headquarters. Uh, what makes this station very unique, again, every station has the unique, unique characteristics. There is a hydrogen pipeline operated by air products and chemicals that runs underneath West 190th Street. We take a spur of that hydrogen from the pipeline, we clean it through a membrane purifier, and then we compress it, we store the hydrogen, and then we dispense it. Now at this station we actually have two different dispensing protocols. One is that 350 bar, which is a non-pre-cooled ambient temperature hydrogen gas. And then we have a 700 bar pre-cooled to minus 20 C uh, gas. Starting in 2002, we delivered hydrogen fuel cell vehicles to the city of Los Angeles and a few other customers as a fleet initiative to learn about the vehicles and the, the kind of customer interaction. Today, we're delivering hydrogen fuel cell vehicles to retail consumers. The F6 Clarity hydrogen fuel cell car, they drive it in normal operations, incorporating it into their daily lives. You know, the Honda Clarity is really a generation skipping hydrogen fuel cell electric vehicle. And by that, I mean that it's really took and moved the needle far beyond what most people thought was possible. You know, 10 years ago, people said you couldn't even make a sedan into a hydrogen car because the components were too big. This proves it is possible, and we're doing it today. When we look at this hydrogen station here today, serving our customers' needs, this is leadership from Shell. We need companies like that to really uh, get in this business, help us along. We're in this pre-commercial stage today, yet for our customers, it's daily operation. So uh, this station is meeting their needs for their daily use of fuel cell vehicles, and we just need more stations and really all pull together to bring this to fruition and for society. Thanks for recharging your batteries with the latest episode of Amped Up AED Vodcast. We'd like to take a quick moment to thank Rick Scott and Steve Ellis, and of course, our viewers. We hope you'll join us again for our next electrifying vodcast. This is the NAFTC, unplugging for now.